In this video, I'm going to be doing a full guide on how to use this yellow wallet tracker that you guys could use in order to track winning wallets. So the first thing you need to do is you need to go to any web browser and just look up yellow wallet tracker. Then go ahead and select over here to the telegram link. It will say contact then at EVM tracker bot. So go ahead and just press on that like so. And I honestly prefer using the telegram bot. It's just significantly faster. And because it's on telegram, you could also do this on mobile as well. So there's just a lot of great options. So let's just go ahead and press on open telegram desktop. So if you don't already have telegram for your desktop then you will need to go ahead and actually you know download it for your desktop so then you will get a message that looks like this to reduce the strain on our main bot and optimize alert delivery please select one of the following bots so go ahead and just select on either one of these it really doesn't matter too much i already did select one earlier all right guys so i'm here in cielo bot number four so uh there's a lot of different options we could do so we have this menu tab which we can go ahead and press and it will give you basically a list of all the different commands and stuff like that but i personally recommend just doing slash menu and then it will basically give you all of the different buttons that it does have to offer all the different like features and stuff like that so we can actually go ahead and track 250 wallets on 25 evm chains so over here we do have the clo app which you guys can go ahead and download and we also do have alert settings right over here so if you want to go ahead and alert something specific then you can definitely do so right over here we also do have channel alerts group alerts bot settings and custom bots as well but if you want to go ahead and actually track a wallet then what we need to do is we need to go ahead and select on this option option that does say add and then go ahead and select on what type of wallet do you want to track so we got the lana wallet we got a regular wallet token tron wallet and a sue wallet as well and you guys could also cancel it so for this video i'm just going to go ahead and track uh, a solana wallet so i'm just going to select on that and then uh over here it is going to give you a bunch of filters that you guys can go ahead and take a look at so honestly if you're looking for something specific then definitely go ahead and fill around with these filters so if you just want to track a wallet go ahead and just press on continue or confirm i should say and then it's going to say enter minimum amount for dfi alerts so this is completely optional so if you want to get alerted on a particular amount then this is where you would actually do it but i'm just going to be skipping it for this video so now what we need to do is we need to go ahead and input a wallet address and then give a label after it so i'm going to go ahead and quickly find a wallet to track so one really good way i recommend you guys do this is by using something similar to like soul scan and basically if you do go ahead and click on a particular token for example we're on official tump token then you go over here to where it says holders then you'll be able to see basically uh, all the purchases that have been made throughout the blockchain and stuff like that and over here we can go ahead and just copy uh wallet address so let's say we want to go ahead and track this guy right over here then what we need to do is we need to go ahead and select on copy address then let's go back to the telegram channel then let's go ahead and paste in the wallet address then include a space and then give this wallet a name so i'm just going to be calling it trump token like so and then i'm just going to enter it in the chat and then there you go, the wallet has been added. So now if we want to go ahead and look at the performance of this wallet, then what we need to do is we need to select on menu, then go ahead and select on a slash list right over here. And then there you go, we do have some wallets that we actually did, um, you know, track previously, and here they are. And you guys can go ahead and select on this option that does say PNL, and this will basically give you the PNL stats for the wallet. So let's go ahead and enter that in. And then enter in a wallet address. Let's do this one, for example. So in this wallet in particular, it will say no trades found for this wallet. Uh, stable swaps ignored. So yeah, you know, it really does depend on what type of wallet you are tracking. Some of the wallets will actually give you a lot of different insights and stuff like that. However, others, maybe not so much. But the point is, you're still able to go ahead and track wallets, see all of the activity, and there's still a bunch of other options that you guys can go ahead and take a look at. If you guys found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I will see you in the next tutorial.